Have you got an old piece of equipment with some sort of connector like this and you've lost the cable it's supposed to go to? Well, you might be able to get one that matches that or you might not. Maybe you're going to have to replace it. But it's really important that you get the gender right. Which bit's male and which bit's female? It's difficult to actually get your head around it, I, I find it so. And maybe this will help you. Obviously, without getting too vulgar, um, you know, one fits into the other, but there's a sense in which this one fits into that, but also the pins of that one fit into this. So which one is male and which one is female? Well, it turns out it, the important part is which pins are exposed. So these are the exposed pins, so they're the male ones. And you never, never, never wire up the male side to a battery, because if that's wired up, you could accidentally short those contacts with a knife, a screwdriver or something. So that's a, just a, an important distinction.